and a group of 10 engineering students from Kumara Guru College of Engineering in Coimbatore have developed a hydrogen powered energy boat which they say is first of kind in India. This is the only team from India which has qualified for the Monaco Energy Boat Challenge. Sam Daniel speaks to some of them. A hydrogen powered boat designed by 10 students of Kumaraguru Institute of Technology in Coimbatore has been chosen for the prestigious Monaco Energy Boat Challenge. In fact, this is the only team from India chosen for this and with me three members of this team. Thank you very much for your time. Congratulations. Tell me about this boat. So this boat is uh, basically fabricated using carbon fiber and it's powered using um, hydrogen and the propulsion system is basically designed by us in-house. So uh, hydrogen, why hydrogen? Uh, the hydrogen is actually a high density energy source uh, where we can store the hydrogen in a tank and we can generate uh, electricity. For a unit of hydrogen you have, uh, how long will this boat sail? For one unit, uh, the boat will up to run up to four to five hours. Like it's more efficient in this kind of project. Right. Yeah. And why carbon fiber? Because the carbon fiber, last year we used aluminum fabricator. Like why carbon fiber this year is that? Because it's less weight and it can be easily drifted and it can be easily handed by the pilot because it's less weight, right? Like it's high efficient too. Uh, tell me about the cost of this project and how did you manage? So the estimated budget for our boat is for around 65 lakhs and until 40 lakhs we have procured it from the companies by pitching through financial support and the components we got from them. And rest we aim for other 20 to 25 lakhs and we are looking forward for crowdfunding and funding from the government. Right. And you didn't have a water body near your campus. How did you manage? So actually we managed that using our smart city lakes in our city. <laughs> uh, basically we took some permissions from the government and our commissioner was very supportive and uh, we just uh, used that lake. If you win this challenge, in what way do you think this technology can be further refined and used? Possibilities, what are the possibilities? Yeah, talking about in our country, this technology is a very new thing. Like compared to the Europeans, very common. Like in India, it's a very normal thing. Like we can use this technology in any kind of e-vehicles that promote sustainability. It's majorly a green energy concept. Normally, IITs participate in this kind of international events. And this time, your college is the only entry from India. How does it feel? Yes, actually, each and every one from the team feels top of the hill every day because we work, we were perceiving, and we just got qualified and everything is set. And uh, firstly, we got an opportunity to promote the sustainability from our nation is a very new thing. And secondly, we hold the pride, like Kumaragura Institution students hold the pride representing the country at the world stage of yachting. So we are happy and we are thrilled. Thank you so much for your time and wish you all the best and these students will be participating in that Monaco Energy Boat Challenge in the first week of July and they want the entire country to root for them. In Chennai with Suresh, Sam Daniel, Find Your TV.